If you guys are looking for super cheap, fast, and reliable Madden 22 Ultimate Team coins, look no further than my sponsor, MuttReserve.com. They're super awesome to work with, and they have 24-7 support. Head over to MuttReserve.com and use code Poodle at checkout for 15% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, I'm going over the Campus Heroes promo, what to expect, how to prepare. Now, if you guys didn't watch yesterday's stream, or any, if you, honestly, if you guys were just somewhat a part of Madden yesterday, you heard about this. Heroes are coming to Madden 22 Ultimate Team now. If you guys knew, if you guys have played Superstar KO Mode or kept up with it, Campus Legends did drop yesterday around 11 a.m., which is how you kind of get your free Odell as well, which I will show you guys in just a second. But if you guys know about that, Campus Legends drop, which pretty much is just people who were legendary college players, right? You guys do see here, limited time game mode, Campus Legends. This game mode is pretty much the precursor for Campus Heroes, or pretty much the out of Madden, out of Mutt version of it. So this is going to be right here. The, if you play in this mode, you will see a ton of different players that you can go ahead and actually play with. And it gives you an idea of what players may be seeing coming to Mutt as well. Now, while Crayla was going over Campus Legends, he did say, guys, Team Diamonds will not be coming how, like, how we expected, which would have been that Friday. They're going to be changing it up. And next week's Friday promo will relate to something that dropped today, which was Campus Legends. So Campus Heroes is more than likely coming on Friday. So if you guys don't know, Campus Heroes is a fun promo where they pretty much take players who had great college careers and have were, were, were campus heroes right heroes on their campus and they take them and they give them to us as mutt players which is exciting for a few reasons because a lot of guys who are legendary in college sometimes they come to the nfl and they flame out and it's not always their fault sometimes it's just a scheme they came to the coach they came to the situation injuries so yeah we never got to see the fruition of these people's careers based on how they played in college this would be the time to get certain guys like johnny manzel i don't know if they'd ever do that but johnny manzel quarterback card would be super cool campus hero for texas a&m um, you know, Baker, Baker Mayfield, Oklahoma. There's a quite a few guys who could potentially get a card here. Tim Tebow for the Florida Gators. I'm excited to see this promo. I'm going to go over kind of what to expect and show you guys kind of the cards and the stats and the art that we did have last year for all this stuff. By the way, if you do want your Odell right above, all you got to do is play this game mode, get a thousand yards. Shouldn't take you long at all with the way defense is played this year. But let's go back to Mutt. So the way Campus Heroes will work, guys, there'll be a set. I don't know if they'll do a master. They probably will, more than likely, but I'm not entirely sure on that one. You know, they could change it up. We haven't had it that many times to so like have like some consistency factor to it. But there'll be a master, more than likely. There's going to be probably about 32 total players, you know, give or take. There's gonna be a, t a ton of them. If I had to guess the overall ranges, I would guess that the campus hero master would probably be around a 92. And the rest of them would probably be around or like a 91, 92, and the rest of them would probably probably 91. Probably 91, 90. And then because of where we are in the game right now, and then we'll probably get all like 88 to 90 campus hero players, if I had to guess, with a bunch of lower players to complete the sets. That's kind of my best opinion on it. To show you guys, it will probably look something similar to kind of how Team Affinity is set up for the most part, where there's like one one player from each, not necessarily from each team, but one player like kind of like that. And then you have to do sets of lower overall players to complete them. And there probably will be a master. I'm not sure who it could be. It could be Tebow. I mean, I, I it would be it would be likely. But I hope they really expand it this year and give us. I want like bigger names. Sometimes they give us players that like decent stats, decent positions. I want to see the Manzels. I, I want to see the create the Vince Youngs. I want to see the crazy players that are the Reggie Bush and those kind of guys. But overall, guys, that pretty much wraps up that. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, turn the noti bell, give this video a big thumbs up. Shout out today for the Poodle Squad goes out to Matt Davis. Shout out to you, man, for being a part of the Poodle Squad. Thank you for showing support each and every day. If you want to be shouted out in the Poodle Squad, all you got to do is like the video, comment down below Poodle Squad, and of course, be subbed. But yeah, that's about it for that, guys. So that's going to be kind of what I expect to see for that. Now, let me go show you guys how to prepare. The thing with preparing for this promo is that there's going to be there's going to be packs, of course. So in terms of having cards ready to go, most of the sets and everything will probably be related to those packs and the new stuff that does come out. So the best you could do is really just have, again, like I said with the other stuff, have some coins ready to go for when it drops. I have some coins saved up ready. I'm ready to go for when it drops. Again, you may like a lot of players. You may like none of the players. But the last thing you want to do, like I always say, is get to the promo and have no coins. And you see Tim Tebow, Johnny Man. You see Johnny Manziel, right? You see some crazy flashback receiver you see reggie bush and you see like ed reed on the miami u right let's just say right that's not the case but and you want all of them now the problem is you don't have any coins so you got to go sell your players and now all your players are going lower in price because everyone's quick selling everyone like go selling them quickly on the block for lower price because they want to go ahead and get these guys as well so make sure you have some coins ready so you don't have to deal with losing a lot of coins trying to get some new players also don't go ahead and buy an entire team before this drops because, again, you may want two to three to four players. Or you may only want one. There will be a master. The masters are usually players you want on your team anyways. So just be ready for that. And, again, if you want to spend money, that's your that's your choice. But there will be packs, obviously. There will be packs. They probably give you a lot of lower pieces to go ahead 
and complete the sets. I mean, otherwise, this promo is pretty usually self-explanatory. I do hope they do drop a solo sequence for it so that we can go ahead and earn something for free. That's kind of my hope, like a nice campus, uh, campus hero solo set, solo set, whether it's lower players or a free hero. I'm cool with either of it. Let me go show you guys what it looked like in past years, especially last year. Right, guys, so last year, this was the hero for the first campus hero drop. As you guys can see, pretty cool card art. We had Herschel Walker for the Cowboys as our first hero. 92 speed, 93 excel. That would be a crazy good back right now, but I don't think we'll get a 92 overall, like I was saying. Based on where we are in the year, I would see, I'd, I think we'd see a 90 or a 91 at best. But this card was good. I'm not going to go through the stats too much. Of course, that was 92. He wouldn't be that good. A uh, Herschel Walker at 90 would probably have a 90 speed flat, which would still make him probably the best back in the game, depending on weight. So here you go. The Campus Heroes program returned to Mutt today for this weekend's Wildcard Wednesday. There are 24, 92 overall Campus Heroes, as well as an 82 overall underclassman version of each player. Similar to the Veteran program, all of today's Campus Heroes get team chemistry for any team they actually played for. So yeah, that's what's cool about this usually too, is that Tim Tebow will have like Jets, Chem, Broncos, Chem, maybe Jaguars, Chem. I don't know if that counts with them, but he'll have, um, I'm blanking here. Jets, Broncos, I'm forgetting Tim Tebow's teams right now. Disregard all of that. But anyways, they'll have all their, they'll have all their chems, which is cool because that means you, they'll be great for theme teams. Uh, okay. So here there will be some, yeah, there'll be 82 plus rear roll packs. We're unlikely with training. So here's some of the players we did get. We got Tim Tebow on the Bronco, oh, Broncos and Jets. Peter Warwick, we got Bruce Matthews, and you can see the stats here, Jonathan Vilma, Ken Norton, David Pollock, Carlos Rogers, Chris Samuels, Jeremy Shockey for the Giants, that was pretty cool, uh, Matt Stinchcomb, Pat Watkins, Vince Wilfork, a few Cowboys in here, Cadillac Williams, Tracy Armstrong, Cornelius Bennett, Leroy Butler, Randy Cross, Nick Fairley, Keyshawn Johnson was a cool one, Maurice Jones, Drew, Matt Leinart, Reggie Nelson, Ozzie Newsom, Herschel Walker. So that was overall the first drop again this was for a wild card wednesday so we're getting this we're probably gonna get ours as a full promo so it could be a little bit different so this is what the second look like the all conference exchanged 32 82 overall players to her fantasy pack where you could get one of them so last year of course like i said when you open a bunch of packs that's what you pretty much do any 82 overall underclassmen players 32 of them you get one of the heroes so that was pretty cool as well now again it could be a little bit different this year because like i said that was more of a wild card wednesday drop this may be like a full friday-esque promo so the store, we had the 82 plus Campus Hero player pack, which was pretty much a reroll pack, 650 training. We had the Campus Hero packs, which were pretty much about nine bucks or 55,000 coins. It contained at least 182 plus, 177 plus, 172 plus, and 268 pluses. So decent, I guess similar to an elite pack kind of, but you're probably going to get a Campus Hero player. Now you had the chance to pull full ones here, pretty, pretty sure as well. And there was the bundle, which was about 55 bucks, give or take. And then of course you got seven Campus Hero packs plus a topper of three 82 plus Campus Hero players. A little six so you see you can see the reroll was here and then um i was pretty much it for that that was our campus hero stuff now if we go on over to this these were the players like i said these were the low 82s that you were able to really pull out of them pretty much low versions of themselves and these are the 82s that you really want and then there was the 85s as well which i think was towards the second drop so disregard that um it was cool it was definitely a cool promo now if you see here these were the 92s again like i showed you they were cool like i said that it was the problem i think by the time they dropped them by the time they dropped them last year, it was a bit later and people didn't care as much. I think it'll be a much better drop this early in the year, quite honestly. And like I said, I hope to see some guys that I want to see some cool. I want to see some guys that not like, like I said, not just anybody, just that you can get in there. Get us some names. Get us some guys that were the top, top, top you know, top of the of the college food chain that everyone knows about. Like, like I said, like Manziel would be cool. I feel like that would be I would I would get a Manziel card. That would be so much fun to play with um virginia tech vic like you know don't give us don't give us a legend this year give us virginia tech vic give us someone that's give us something new and interesting that we're not expecting but guys about it for the video hopefully you guys did enjoy if you're new to the channel hit that subscribe button turn that noti bell give this video a big thumbs up as always comment down below poodle squad like the video and of course be sub to the channel thank you guys for watching i'm out peace